I'm here in the supply room um, and I'm just gonna do uh, a little bit of a, a fix. So the problem that I see or the waste that I see is that we've got uh, different levels of inventory for a bunch of products, but we don't really have an idea of how much we use or how much we go through. So I'm just gonna do a simple, um, a simple thing uh, to try to start to figure that out and I'll get back to you with the change. All right, so we've got a sign here that kind of shows the improvement a little. It says stop when adding supplies, mark package with month and year. And there's also a note, if you take the last item, leave a note on the counter. So I know this isn't the be all and end all of inventory systems, but it's kind of a starting point to figure out like, what are we going through? How much is it? So if you look at an item like our staples, you can see I've noted on top, November, 2019. Uh, same with these paper clips. Uh, if you look at the envelopes, you can see it says November 2019. So that's not when we got them, but that's now. And just a way to be able to look back in a couple months and see, you know, do we still have these boxes? What's the turnover of this inventory? So that we can have a better sense um, of how much we need to keep and uh, uh, what that looks like. Um, and then down here, same thing uh, with the packages of paper. We've got that noted on the box and on the packages um, that we had that. So uh, it's the beginning of an improvement, hopefully, just to better control our inventory and uh, not only to not run out, but also just to not stock really large quantities if it's not necessary.